Hello everyone, how are you today? So many people ask me so many questions. One of the main things is how do I not get any spots? So I just thought I would do a full skincare routine. Why not? Just make it really easy for you guys and just show you everything that I use and products that I recommend and stuff like that. So, so yeah, if you wanna see my skincare routine, then keep on watching this video. The first things first, it's like a myth to think that you've got oily skin or dry skin or whatever. Like everyone's skin should just be normal. So if your skin is oily or dry or whatever, then you're actually not using the right skincare for your skin. Like your product should be doing something. So if you're oily, you're using all the skincare and you're still oily, then your skincare is literally like doing nothing for you. It's not doing its job, basically. Generally, guys, I do not get spots at all. <laughs> and I honestly, it's a testament to my skincare because when I've, whenever I've been on holiday and I've been on a bender, let's say, and I have not been using my skincare, that is when I start to see my skin go oily. That's when I start to see spots. That's when I start to see everything. So, if you wanna know the secrets, let's get to it. Okay, so one of the first things I wanna to talk to you about is removing makeup. So one of the main reasons that people actually get spots is because they don't remove their makeup properly. And people would say, oh, don't wear too much makeup because um, you're gonna get spots, you're gonna get lots of spots. Does this skin look spotty to you? No, a lot of people use makeup wipes to remove their makeup. So this is literally like step one for me. I use these yes to ones. I usually get them on Beauty Bay. They are the best and there's this specific one and it's the tomato one and they're black. So the wipes are all black and literally guys, you could just go like this and I just, don't, I don't even know what is in these wipes, but they are like the best wipes that I've ever used. So I use wipes, but only as the first layer. I just use them to remove most of the makeup and then I'll go in with my LMS makeup remover. I use the LMS White Flowers Eye and Lip Makeup Remover and it's basically like a kind of, it's kind of oily, so it really gets rid of like mascara, it gets rid of eyeliner, I use so many things like setting sprays for example, translucent powder, so my makeup's fixed on. So I need something oily to break down that makeup and actually get through it. So yeah, I love, love, love using this. So if I'm really tired and I wanna take off my makeup in the shower for example, um, I use this. So it's the Elemis Pro Collagen Balm. You just literally put it on your face. You see, it's really shiny. So you just put it on your face and you massage it in and it literally like removes everything. And with this one, I don't have to use two steps. I don't have to do a wipe, then a makeup remover or whatever. I literally just go in with this and it just removes all of my makeup. Now I'm gonna go onto face washes. Once I've removed my makeup of an evening or in the morning, obviously before I put on makeup, I use a face wash and it's either one of two, right? So I have this Elemis, which is a gentle foaming face wash. I really like this one just because it's simple. It doesn't like have any particular smell to it. It just does what I need it to, which is clear my skin and yeah. Or I'll use this bad boy. So this is a Glam Glow exfoliating face wash. So with this one, you get all the good stuff, right? So you get, it's a, it's a cleanser and at the same time, it's an exfoliator. But yeah, I quite like this one because it's a gentle exfoliator, so it doesn't hurt the skin. And it's really important to use gentle exfoliators, guys, because I found that when I've used like really rough ones, my skin tends to get oily. So let's move on to face masks. I like when a face mask is instant. And I know that so many are like, oh, use two to three times a week and you'll see results in three weeks, but I just don't have that level of dedication. I'm like, I need this to work now. I'm going out tonight. I need this mask to work like ASAP Rocky. Let me show you what kind of masks I use. Okay, so I have some sheet masks here. So I have some Sephora ones, and then I have um, a Glam Glow one. Now, if you ever get a chance to go into a Sephora, these are literally like $4 or something. I'm gonna actually put one on so that you guys can see. So this is what a sheet mask looks like. Traditional masks, obviously you have to put them on, you have to wait for a bit, sometimes it can get messy, you have to wash it off with water, and that's all good and well if, you're, if you've got time, honey. Or it's something like this, you literally can just put it on, you leave it on for 10 minutes, you take it off and your skin is literally so fresh. So I'm just gonna leave this on for about 10 minutes. And as I do that, I'm gonna talk to you about some of my favorite traditional masks. Ooh, we have two Glam Glow ones actually that I really love, but it's the Youth Mud and the Super Mud. 
So the youth mod is actually an exfoliating mask. So you put it on and you literally like exfoliate it in and you can feel it instantly working. Now my favorite mask is the Glam Glow Super Mod. So it's kind of like a dark gray and it is a very minty. It literally will feel like your skin is burning. I'm not even exaggerating. Like the first time I put it on, I was like, oh my God, am I literally like having an allergic reaction? Because <laughs> it is so strong and it kind of goes hot almost. But wow, the results. Like guys, when you've put this mask on, it will literally create holes where you have pores, where it's literally sucked into the pores and like ripped the gunk out. So this is instant. Results are flawless guys, flawless. So those are the face masks. I'm gonna take this bad boy off now. So yeah, skin is feeling fresh right now. Woo! I also have something else, right? And this is from Mask Bar. So I use these on all makeup clients. So if I ever have a job, I literally put this under their eyes. And guys, this is like a savior of all saviors. Can't even see it, but yeah, they're on. Um, these are really, really cool actually. They literally kind of smooth your eyes instantly. They help with dark circles over time. It's just that bit of luxury that you just need. So yeah, I'm gonna leave these eye masks on while we move on to toners. So guys, toners for me are the most important skincare step. This is where my life changed. This is how I stopped getting spots, is all through a toner. You need an extreme toner to do the job. Guys, I've used random toners, okay? I've used them. They don't do anything. You need a good toner, and I can't express this enough. If you don't want to get spots, if you want to stop getting spots, if you want clear skin, toner is the answer. Like, I've bought this twice now because it's it's that amazing. And that is the Alpha H Liquid Gold Toner. It's basically got glycolid glycolic acid in and the reason that that product is so important is because it strips your skin it's basically like having a skin peel every single day but a gentle one and what it does is it removes the like flaky layers of skin so if you're using something like this you don't even need to use an exfoliator i don't know what more to say really but this is why i don't get spots this is why my skin's so clear this is why my pores have closed so much it's because of this one product and if i find that i've got like a little like spot or something like that before my time of the month i literally put this toner on there and the next day i wake up and it's absolutely got like it's gone and now that i've toned and <laughs> put a mask on my skin i'm going to talk to you about moisturizers glam glow water burst um it smells beautiful by the way oh but it's the lightest cream that i've probably ever ever used very, very lightweight, but it really, really moisturizes the skin. So this is great for anyone that doesn't like to use a lot of moisturizer or you feel like your skin can get quite oily in the day, you know, anything like that. This is so good for that. Last but not least, lip care. Moisturize my lips. I do use a few different things, but there's one thing that consistently stays in my bag and that is this EOS lip balm. Very cute, very, very cute. And I literally just cream it on. I love Vaseline, I love Carmex, I love all these things that come in a tin, but sometimes if I have my acrylics on, and then I have to like, dig, if I dig it in and then it goes in, into my nail, or I have to dig the other way, and it's just really annoying. So this is really cool, just so easy, you just put it on, put it back in, and you're done. You don't have to touch your lips. So guys, I really hope that you've enjoyed listening to my favorite skincare products and what my skincare routine is. If you have any questions about skincare or any of these products, please definitely ask below and I will answer your questions. Also, don't forget to look at the description box because I will list all of these products with the links to purchase them if you're interested in any of them. Yeah, I'm gonna go and get ready now because I'm off to go out to a club, whoop, 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 going to party with my friends and my sister, so yeah. I'll see you in my next video and I really hope you enjoyed this one. Bye!